guys, it's your girl Queen, the girl from around the way. And I just have something to say. What the fuck? That's exactly how I've been feeling lately. But to piggyback off of my morning video, I was walking past this guy that had hollered at me like a while ago, right? And I was saying to myself, like, what? Did he just ask me? Did he just ask me to treat him to breakfast? He didn't just ask me that. Now, get this, fellas, ladies, kings and queens. I'm not offended by it. Taken aback by it, yes, because as a female, I was always shown and taught by my father that the man is the head of household, the man runs things, and the man is the provider, the one who will take care of you. And for some reason, that seems to not be the case of today's generation. We are literally living in a world full of man-child. Men who are still children. It is okay to be a kid at heart, but there is a time and place for everything as Ecclesiastics chapter three states, there is a time for everything under the sun. I'm not saying it to be religious, but I'm saying it as something that I was taught when growing up. That if it had not been for my father uh, giving me guidance in what it is that I needed to have out of a man, I probably wouldn't have this mindset. But I watched my father go to work, come back, wash us, clothe us, take us to the school bus, stand with us, stand with us at the school bus. He would come up to the school and check in on us. He would take us out on trips. We would go travel. We would go on vacation. Whatever it is that I did as a child growing up, my father's involvement was very much prevalent. So now, now in this day and age when you don't even have that as something that's just constantly going, it just makes you wonder to yourself, what is going on with our men of today's generation? Like, they're totally a different breed. Where, you know, what happened along the lines of families? Has this always been the mission? I mean, it's kind of dumb to ask that, but was that the mission since slavery? And I'm just specifically speaking to that of um, the culture of black men and women. Um, I'm, I'm mad that I'm even using the label black, but just from our culture period, our families were just not ever meant to stay together. The man was not ever supposed to be the man, the head. And then you wonder why our women of today are not that sympathetic or catering to our men the way that we would like them to. I'm just saying, talk to me. Let me know what's up, y'all. It's your girl, Queen, the girl from around the way.